What's going on, Planet SOM family? It's your main man, JD. Thank you for tuning in. Today, we're gonna be doing some unboxing. Now, I ordered my uh, LA Laker championship gear like about 10 days ago, and I want you guys to experience it with me. So check it out. Now, for those of you who don't know, I'm from and I live in San Diego. And, um, Oh, well, I've been a Laker fan my whole life, so I'm just so so excited to uh, to receive my gear. Man, I'm so excited! It looks so beautiful. So let's see, let's check it out. Wow! Check that out. Man, it looks so nice. So I got myself a, um, a hat. I mean, I've been waiting for this for a long time. I mean, my Lakers have been, um, <clears throat> won a championship in 10 years. And I just been waiting for this. I mean, watching the, the Warriors who are a division rival, I mean, have their amazing run. I mean, shout out to them. Cause I mean, they put on some good basketball during the years. But hey, it was just my time to see my team win. Um, but hey, you know, sometimes it's hard to uh, see a division rival, you know, win championships. But hey, you know, they put up some good, some good basketball, entertaining basketball. Got myself the shirt, a large shirt. Let's see how it looks. What do you guys think? I don't know, I really like the design. First thing I did as soon as uh, I saw them win the championship, and I went ahead and I ordered my, my merch. I had to, you know, I had to support the team. I was so excited, waited 10 years for this. Our 17 championship. What do you guys think? I don't know, man, I just think it's beautiful. I mean, look, look at the design. I love how, how it's black and then the and how the gold just stands out. I don't know, I think it's an amazing hat. What do you guys think? Hey, go Lakers. Well, I remember uh, growing up a Laker fan my whole life. Um, well, being from San Diego, you know, we don't have a team out here. I mean, we did have, I wanna say like two teams, two NBA teams um, before I was born. Like. The Clippers, they were uh, they were the San Diego Clippers, and um, they were over here for a while. However, they moved to LA back in like '84, back in 1984, and that was before I was born. So, I mean, I couldn't really enjoy a team here in my hometown. Um, we also had the San Diego Rockets, and well, right now they're the Houston Rockets. And uh, well, that was a long time ago, like back in the 60s. I think they moved like in the early 70s, I wanna say. Um, fun fact, you know Pat Riley, the uh, president for the Miami Heat? Well, he was actually the first round draft pick for the San Diego Rockets. And uh, just fun fact, fact check me if, if I'm wrong. I'm just so happy that my team won a championship again. I mean, uh, growing up a Laker fan, <clears throat> I, uh, I've been blessed to see them win like six rings. Obviously Kobe won five, and now with LeBron, they just won one. And um, it was just cool to just grow up and cheer for my team. I remember, I remember being a fan way before Kobe was drafted. And obviously he wasn't drafted by the Lakers, but he was traded on draft day to the Lakers. And um, that was an amazing 20 years to watch Kobe win for my team. Um, I was I was too young to experience the Magic and Bird era, you know, the Showtime Lakers. But I'm just happy I was able to experience the Kobe Shaq era and then now with the LeBron era. I honestly don't remember a time in my life when I wasn't a Laker fan. I remember back in elementary school when I used to play basketball. You know, I used to I used to love the sport and I was on basketball teams. I, I would have little trophies. I was pretty good as a kid, you know, in elementary school. Um, 
and I would love to watch the Lakers. You know, back in the day, like in the forum, before the Staples Center. And, um, and I grew up in the 90s, so that was the Michael Jordan era. You know, you had Michael Jordan win six championships in the 90s. Obviously, everybody was a big Michael Jordan fan. However, I never jumped on that bandwagon. Matter of fact, right now in my early 30s, um, I actually just bought my first pair of J's. If I ever had a basketball shoe, it wouldn't be J's just because I always thought Kobe was better than Jordan, but that's just me. So I couldn't get on that Michael Jordan bandwagon. Um, matter of fact, like I said, uh, I grew up in the 90s. So I remember being a kid when Space Jam came out. And obviously, you know, you got MJ and the Looney Tunes all up in the movie. And obviously it's, it's, a, it's a kid's movie. And um, even though the popularity of Michael Jordan and I mean, you just combine it with the Looney Tunes. I mean, a lot of kids really like Michael Jordan. However, I remember watching Space Jam and my favorite part was when uh, the Lakers were at the forum and they refused to, uh, to get dressed because they were so scared to, to lose their talent. I remember uh, a player said, man, a bacteria like that, it can move faster than the speed of light or something like that. I don't know, I just thought it was hilarious, especially because they refused to go in the locker room and then they had to put on a gas mask just to get dressed to uh, play in the game. So I thought it was pretty funny. However, um, man, I was just so excited to see my team finally win another championship. Shout out to my Lakers. I'm so happy that uh, they won another one. They finally tied it up. Um, well, as far as championships, because the Boston Celtics, they have 17. And now we have 17, so we tied it up as far as championships. And uh, well, as far as the Boston Celtics goes, I'm just happy that um, even though I wasn't in the era of Magic Johnson and Larry Bird, I wasn't born during that era, uh, I'm just happy that I got to see Kobe. Even though, yes, he did lose one, what was that, uh, in 08 against the Big Three um, up in Boston. It was uh, Garnett, Ray Allen, and Paul Pierce. However, two years later, after he won in 09 with or against um, the Magic in, in 2010, the final, the final ring that Kobe got, he ended up beating the Celtics. And it was just pretty cool just to see, I guess you could say it's like nostalgia for old NBA fans and the history behind it to see the Lakers and the Celtics in the, uh, in the finals. I mean, yes, Kobe did lose one against the Celtics. However, he did come back and beat him. So that was pretty cool just to see that. Cause I mean, Magic even lost to the Celtics, you know, cause Larry, Larry Bird and obviously Magic won in, uh, in the finals. So it was just pretty cool to see. Uh, now that LeBron is with my team, honestly, uh, I thought the, uh, the Celtics were gonna go ahead and uh, play in the finals this year. Cause they were in the Eastern Conference Finals. But hey, it didn't happen, but maybe maybe next year or something. So thank you guys for tuning in. I just wanted you guys to experience the unboxing of my Lakers championship gear. I appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and turn on that notification bell so YouTube could notify you every single time I drop a video. Go Lakers, thanks.